guys, welcome back to my channel and of course, there's <clears throat> my voice, huh. welcome if you are new here, I am Francesca, if you haven't seen this face before, then please go ahead and click that big subscribe button, you shall see it in the down bar down below, please go ahead and click it and also after you've watched this video and you liked it, then do please go ahead and leave me a massive thumbs up, it'll make my day, no rambling, let's get into the video. So today's video is really exciting and it's something different, um, different for me anyhow. I've recently been very kindly sent this product. Now this is a keratin hair treatment kit. I have no idea really what keratin is, um, but I shall Google that in a minute. So this is the Nutri Amazonian List, uh, the real Brazilian keratin kit and majority of it isn't in English, so I'm not too sure what it says. Basically it just says, the luxurious elixir of Amazon Brazil creates smooth and silky hair for up to four months, suitable for all hair types. You have three step system, you have shampoo, smoothie treatment and the intensive repair mask. And it just has a bit of information on the back, so I shall, I shall go ahead and read it out for you. Discover the combination that can offer you the smooth effects of your dreams. From the heart of Amazon Brazil arises a new revelation. Extremely smooth effect here in the first application. With Amazon List you'll get 100% smooth effect, magnificent and healthy hair has never been easier. Its extraordinary formula is the perfect communion between the majestic antioxidant powder of the acai berry and the intense discipline of cocoa to provide maximum reduction of volume of the hair and quality so superior that impresses even the most skeptical professionals. Fall in love with your new smoothing hair with Amazonian Liss. So yeah, I recently got sent this to me by the company Nutri. They actually reached out to me and asked if I'd like to try this product and I said yes because it's something very different for me. Like I said, I don't know too much about keratin and I thought it'd be really really good to try it out for you guys as I've actually YouTubed this and hardly, there's hardly any videos on this so I thought I'd be one of the first people to really try it out so I'm actually going to go to Google and see if we can find a bit more out about this product so I've actually Googled it and this retails from anywhere from £55 upwards the treatment you can actually get in a few different sizes there's small, medium and large the large retails for approximately $229 which is uh, hell expensive and the small retails for about $55 so I shall leave a few of the links to this down below if you are interested in buying it um, the new tree company actually does have a website if you actually subscribe to their newsletter you will get 10% off your first order which is really good and you can actually buy this product from their website as well as I said, the large it retails for $219. So, inside this little kit you get a three-step system. So I'm going to go ahead and open this up. Ooh. Straight away, it's a very nice smell, that. Mmm. I really know what that smells, but it smells really, really nice. Oh, actually, I forgot to Google what is keratin. Let's see that. Or what is the purpose of the keratin treatment. <clears throat> Hey Google. Hello Google. Hey Google. Why is it working? What is the purpose of a keratin hair treatment? According to WebMD, time saving tresses. If you usually style your hair straight, a keratin hair straightening treatment could shorten your blow dry time by 40% to 60%, says hairstylist Henry Bourdais of New York's Mizu Salon and corporate educator for global keratin. And there you have it. It also says, farewell frizz, you can forget about the frizzy treatment. Oh, wait, what? <sighs> farewell frizz, you can forget about the frizzy hair after treatment. So this is mainly suitable for people that like to wear their hair straight a lot of the time, which is me. I kind of like to differ between hair straightening and hair curling, but like for the purpose of this video and this treatment, I will now continue to keep straightening my hair. This says it lasts up to four months, for the next four months I will keep straightening my hair or until the treatment fades, so we will just see. So yeah, back to the box. 
very smells very nice so there's three steps in here so let's take these out oh, these cute little balls oh <laughs> they're so dinky so these are 60 ml or 2.03 ounce so you get step one step two and step three so step one is the anti-residue shampoo step two is a brazilian smoothing treatment and step three is the intensive repair mask because that's just what you get inside the box then inside comes with a like on the inside here you have like the instructions i'm gonna go ahead and flatten this box just so i can like read what to do kind of wish it would have come with like a separate instruction leaflet i think that would be more helpful to like how to destroy the box so you can actually read like what you have to do Go ahead and flatten this box. Ah, right, there we go. Step by step, Amazonian list Brazilian keratin. Absolute smoothing effects for damaged frizzy and dull hair. So before I start this, I shall tell you a little bit of background about my hair. Now, for those of you wondering, I don't have naturally black hair. I've been dyeing my hair since I was about 14 years old, and I've always had black hair since then. I've had like ombre hair and then like box dye hair, hairdresser, salon, hair dye. So like obviously my hair is quite dry sometimes, especially now it is really greasy, it doesn't need washing. I thought there's no point washing it when now I need to wash it with this treatment. Um, so my ends, I have had quite a few inches cut off my hair but my ends are still a little bit dry. My hair, it takes ages to blow dry and when I do blow dry it is a it is, <laughs> it is extremely frizzy and no matter what products I use just doesn't help with the frizziness it is really really frizzy so really hoping that this treatment as it claims will help cut down blow drying time and make my hair less frizzy so I should go ahead and read through the steps and then we shall get cracking preparation step one wash the hair with step one anti-residue shampoo massaging into a lather leave for five minutes rinse repeat the operation for virgin hair or resistant hair so that's step one so i'm gonna go ahead and go and wash my hair with step one so let's go <laughs> completed now when washing my hair I did notice a lot of my hair color was coming out the water was running purple which is not good I wouldn't say that this is for all hair types I would not recommend use this for colored treated hair if I known about this I probably wouldn't have agreed to use it because it has took out a lot of color um, now most shampoos I guess do tend to take some colour out of my hair just because my hair is dyed black but this treatment it was just the water was just pure purple like it took out a lot of colour from my hair so that's kind of annoying but hey ho that is step one completed so now for step two it says use a hair dryer and hands to dry hair to about 85% dry so I shall go ahead and do that and I shall be right back okay so my hair is about 80% dry-ish it's not stopping wet but it's not bone dry either already I noticed that that took me literally less than five minutes I know it's not 100% dry but usually it takes me like a good 20 minutes to blow dry my hair also it's not as frizzy already usually my hair is just like but the minute is not looking too shabby so now moving on to the next step so the next step says section the hair to six equal parts with hair clip so i didn't use all of step one as i wasn't too sure exactly how much i should use i think i used about a third of the bottle so i probably could still get another two to three treatments out of that which is really really good so now to section this into six is it six six equal parts <laughs> Bye. 
five and six. Oh, missed a bit. <laughs> so we have one, two, three, four, five and six. Now moving on to the next step. So it says application. Apply the step two Brazilian smoothing treatment. In one section, start from the base of the head. Open the section in half and apply the product on the upper and lower parts of the section. Use a fine tooth comb to comb through the entire section from roots to end. Make sure the whole length of the hair is covered by the product. Do not over saturate. So I think it would be easier to empty this into a tint bowl, use a tint brush just to apply it. So that's exactly what I'm going to do. Again, I don't really know how much I'm supposed to use of this. Um, so I, I'm just going to go ahead and wing it. I don't have a lot of hair so I probably won't need too much. So let's just see. Oh, it's very creamy. I won't use all of it. Oh, it has that little um, like orange speckles in it. Mm, it smells really, really nice. Start from the base of the head, open section in half and apply the product on the upper and lower parts of the section. So I'm just going to start from the back ones first and we'll split this in half. I'll start with this first. Probably again this everywhere at the table. Use a fine tooth comb to comb through the entire section from roots to end. Make sure the whole of the hair length is covered. So I just have my little pink comb here and comb that through. And I'm just putting each little bit on at a time and then just smoothing it out with my hands first. Just so I can get up in the roots easier. And I'm just going to go ahead and repeat this on the other side. So that's the first two sections with the step two treatment on. Now I'm just going to fast forward through the rest of my hair and I'll be right back. So that is step four complete. I am going to say is wow my eyes are like burning. The smell of it is oh just make me feel a bit dizzy. It's just oh it's very overpowering. Powering. It's very overpowering the smell. I don't know what, I don't, like is there a load of chemicals in it? Like I'm not too sure but it's just making my nose, like my eyes burn. What I will say is my hair is almost, like almost dry. That carotid trip from the bottom has pretty much all been soaked up. So that is step four complete, now on step five and it says, with the hair dry set to cold air, dry the sections completely without brushing. I oh, shall go ahead and do that and I should be right back. So I've blow dried my hair on the cold setting and it's not 100% dry but it'll do. I just can't keep drying it. I can't tell you how powering that smell is. Honestly, my throat is burning. I actually had to go stand outside. I had tears coming out of my face. Just, I really wouldn't recommend you this treatment if you are pregnant or you have asthma. Just, oh. Like when I first opened the box I thought wow it smells really good but oh. honestly it's like having bleach in the room it smells awful now and it's just it is so so strong and I feel like that this smell isn't going to go out of my room it smells really really strong I just couldn't keep blow drying my hair because oh like my nose and throat is just burning oh god <laughs> so the next step is straightening so it says number six divide the hair into four parts and then flat iron the hair from eight to ten times from root to the middle of the strands and from four to six times on the ends the flat iron flat iron temperature flat iron temperature should range between 380 Fahrenheit to 450 Fahrenheit okay so four do I brush my hair now so I don't want to straighten my hair my hair, let me tell you, isn't feeling smooth. It feels very knotty and sticky and, oh, I don't know. I'm hoping it'll improve when I straighten it because the minute it just feels really 
it's gross I could just want to go in and like scrub it so four sections oh guys I cannot tell you the smell oh I really don't know if I could do this again just the smell is oh honestly it's so grim right now oh I actually have my window open now so I'm really sorry to hear any traffic I think just trying to get the smell out of my bedroom I'm going to brush it I think you brush it now I don't see how straightening this would work so I'm just gonna brush through it just very gently so it says to four iron the hair from eight to ten times from root to the middle so let's go ahead and do that first so middle should go about here so I'm going to literally run over it three times there these even turned up so I'm just going to repeat this process throughout the whole of my head and I should be back in the jiffy. I don't know if you can tell by my eyes but oh, I have legit tears coming out of my face. The smell is, oh, honestly, I really don't think I could use this again. It's making my eyes burn really, really bad. I'm just trying to get through this as quick as possible just so I can get it done because, oh my god, it's really, really, really strong so I'm almost finished straightening my hair and then we shall move on to the final few steps so I've just finished doing that step it literally looks like I've been crying my eyes out my eyes were just oh they will not stop watering just oh no I keep going about the smell but oh so that my hair is looking pretty good it feels mm, it feels greasy I don't know if I've, I've I think I've definitely put a bit too much product on up in the roots because it just looks really greasy at the minute so I've probably put a bit too much on. Down here it doesn't look too bad and it's not as frizzy as normal but it is still pretty frizzy although the top is not looking too shabby at the moment. Quite impressed with that, it's not as frizzy at the top but like everywhere else it's still a bit frizzy but definitely not as much so let's see what the next step is so it says step number seven is repeat the ironing straightening process in all of the hair always make sure to take fine and linear strands of hair throughout the entire head so I'm just going to go ahead and section my hair like I normally would when I straighten it and I'm just going to go ahead and straighten all of it again but in smaller sections this time so that is step <coughs> 7 complete it's about as straight as I'm going to get it it's not looking too bad I know I have missed some bits but the frizz isn't as bad just my hair it definitely feels greasy up here I definitely put too much product on so that is no one's fault but mine down here it doesn't feel too bad it feels smooth and soft it's just up here that's the problem so but if i want to do this again i definitely use less product up here so now on to the finalizing step so it says step eight rinse the hair oh i've got to rinse it all out just straight and took me like almost half an hour to straighten my hair i've got to rinse it all again why Step 8, rinse the hair and it says apply the step 3 intensive repair mask and work it through the hair. Leave it on to 3 to 5 minutes and rinse again and then blow dry your hair. So let's go ahead and go and wash this perfectly straight hair and apply the step 3 <laughs> treatment. Hopefully it will wash away some of the smell because I just can't tell you like, oh, I feel a bit sick now I'm not going to lie. So let's go ahead to the bathroom and rinse this hair out again. So that's the final step on. Now it just says to uh, da, 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 blow dry the hair and that is it. So I'm going to go ahead and blow dry this and I will, if need to, strain it again. So I'm going to go ahead and dry my hair and I should be right back. 
so this is how my hair is looking after I have blow dried it so it's definitely a hella shiny I mean look at that shine that just looks really, really healthy it feels a lot better now I've washed it out that horrible treatment just ugh. the smell thankfully it's not as strong just oh thankfully that smell is gone that conditioner had like a different smell thankfully it's not as strong as the treatment itself so frizz wise not too bad there's hardly any frizz on top da, da, da. as you can see there's hardly anything there but it's just like the frizz is still here like underneath and that so maybe I didn't put enough on on like the mid to end sections whereas I did put too much on the top so if I were to do this again I would probably go ahead and put just a bit more on the middle and end of my hair now I am just going to go ahead and give this a one last straighten and then we should look at the before and after and do a comparison so I'm just going to sort this hair out so I'm just going to rub my straightness through my hair I'm going to section it off again and I'll just clip this out of the way I'm just going to work on this section here I love how shiny it is, it looks so good it feels super soft as well so I'm just going to roughly straighten it I'm not like too bothered if it's perfectly straight or not that was the whole idea of the treatment and it's like 95% straight it's going to go for the last 5% and there we have it hello keratin treated hair so let's do a before and after <laughs> So this is after So right away I can tell of course it is hella shiny, it just looks really, really healthy and glossy, it feels, I'd say it feels a bit soft and not anything too dramatic though, I did already have kind of soft hair before. One thing I will say is my hands are feeling extra dry as anything, I think if I were to do this again I most definitely would use gloves because my hands feel really really dry and hard and I have to use like half tub of hand cream just to try and repair these so also when blow drying my hair I did notice that it didn't take as long to dry my hair and of course it isn't as frizzy like the frizz has probably been cut down to at least half like maybe more than that like I said next time I will definitely use more of the treatment on the mids to ends of my hair because I think they're still a bit frizzy um, so I would definitely use more treatment however the top actually I thought I put too much on but to say that the top is super sleek and straight and just really frizz free so maybe I did put too much on not too sure so would I use this again a bit 50 50 just because of the smell that was really uncomfortable for me I felt very sick my eyes were streaming sore throat nose if i were to do this again i'd probably either do it outside or with like a big ass fan in front of me um so yeah i'm a bit 50 50 on that but i'm definitely really impressed with the results it's got believe how shiny it looks and it feels really soft and smooth and i'm just i'm actually glad i tried this and thank you so much for sending me this product out new treat i really do appreciate it and i do hope you enjoy my review of your product I am not being paid for this, these opinions are of my own. Of course, if I don't like it, I'm going to say I don't like it. If I do like it, I will say I like it. You know, I'm very honest with you guys, and that's the way it's always going to be on this channel. 
I know some YouTubers tend to lie about things just because they're being paid for it. Like I said, I am I'm not being paid for it and these are all my honest opinions. So yeah, this has been my review slash first impression on the Amazonian List Keratin Treatment. So again, thank you to Nutri for this product. I really hope you enjoyed this first impression. If you did, please go ahead and subscribe. Don't forget to leave a like and comment. Also, I love replying to your guys. So thank you so much for watching and I shall see you all next time. Thanks guys, bye.